Would you do 40 for all those? What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode. Today we're gonna do something a little bit different. We're gonna go back down to Kobe's swap meet, but it's actually about noon right now. So I'm gonna try and see if I go a little bit later if there's anything new down there. So a lot of times when I show up right at 7 a.m., there's still vendors that are coming in to the swap meet and by the time I check out the entire thing and leave, I feel like there's a couple people that I missed. So what we're gonna do today is head down there, see if there's anything that we can find later on in the day. Wish me luck. Hello. Hello. How much are your beanies? Five dollars. Five dollars. I'll take these two. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. All right. There's two of them. There's that one. There's another green one in that. What do you got on those? Oh, uh, ten bucks. Ten bucks. You take five. I could do eight. Eight. No. No. See if there's anything else, I'll group it together for you. Ten? No, I gotta do twelve for both. Twelve? I need five and eight for that, so it'd be thirty. Right, I'll do twelve. Twelve is good. Yeah, that's good. Awesome man. Appreciate you working with me. Thank you. How much is this stuff? Five bucks. Five bucks. Well. Right, Thank you. Yep. Do you have any other ones other than these? Uh, no, that's not like no. that, brother. Okay. Appreciate it. Yep. Yes. Yeah. Let me see. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. So this is a it's a gimbal. So it it's, it stabilizes your footage. So can I take it out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I just want to see what kind of they use it for the phone or what? That's what I'm going to look at and see what it's used for. So <clears throat> It can be so this you would put on here, right? You could put a phone on it. What is that for for the phone? So it's for a phone and a camera. Now, yep. a million dollar question, what does this go for? What does it go for? Let's play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Um, I'd probably let it go for like 50, 60 bucks. Mm. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm. Have a good day though, good luck. You can have the bosses or whatever. All right. Hey, help yourself to some agave. Does this thing work? It's brand new, never been opened out, I think, as far as I really? know. Make me a really good deal. It says 10 bucks on there, that's a pretty good deal. All right. <laughs> I just don't know, this isn't factory tape, so. I don't know either, man. I inherited it from a, a storage unit. So yeah, makes sense. I don't think it's been opened. If it has, it's been, it looks like they kept the box and put it back in it. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome to open it if you want. Can I, do you got a knife or something? Mm. I got keys, but. That's a good deal, even if the cable's in there, it's worth it. Yeah. We'll see. We will yeah, see. Yeah, USB cable, like that's about time yeah. new, so. But that could be fixed. Oh, that's What do you have on the hats? 
Uh, how about three dollars? Three dollars? Brand new, my friend. If I get both of them, will yes, you do five? Five, yes. That's a good deal. <laughs> Wait, a good present, maybe. I like those. Yeah. Let me see. Here we go. There you are. Gracias, Thank you. We have on the clubs. What are you asking on these? I got berries and prices. They own it. The, uh, okay. All mixed, you know? Okay. What What about this kind? The the Nikes. Yeah. I can go sixty dollars for the set. Sixty dollars. So it's not going to be easy. It's going to be really hard. Do you know? Which they, ones you have on there? I think they all it's a, the, all the drives, the, the, all the irons are there. And yeah. I, I think it's a potter with it too. There's a potter somewhere, it's a, huh? It's, it's a potter somewhere here. Okay. Unless I sold it, but I don't think I sold it. Gotcha. <laughs> Would you do 40 for all those? Cause I don't see a putter or a pitching wedge or That's fine. any yeah, other wedges driving. for him. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Oh. I the putter, but I remember somebody Did you sell it maybe? Yeah, uh, yeah, I might have sold it because this guy bought a hundred dollars worth of potters and drivers. Gotcha. You know? he might have Let me see. That one. Yeah, seven. I think this one might go with it. Well, that's a link. That's a. But at this one, I gotta charge you 10 bucks. 10, 10 bucks? Okay, let me see. Three, four. This, that's a good potter, though. Five, six, seven, eight. How about nine. 45? Throw this one. 45 for this one? Five. They're nice. Hey, okay. Okay, that's all good. Thank you. That's actually a good potter. Is it? I'll take your word for it. But those Nikes, eh? I sure did. It's gonna do well. Not bad, right? Yeah. Been watching golf lately, yeah, a little bit. Been playing since I was five. Really? Yeah. Are you on the yeah. tour? I'm not, no, I wish. <laughs> Here you are, 45? Yeah, cool. Here you are, my friend, thank you. Yeah, thank you very much. Why Take it easy. Good? Huh? Why aren't you good? Now? Have you seen those guys? Those guys are crazy good now. It's insane. I, I took a little hiatus in between high school and college, okay. and I just play for you're fun. You're good enough. You know what it is? What? It's golfing every day. Yeah. And then your number comes up. You know these golfers, you find out... The real good, one, good ones are obviously like Tiger Woods, I get it. Of course, These of course. Freaks. Yeah. But, uh, I was a tennis pro. Uh huh. Have a good one, man. Nice talking to you. What are you asking on the jersey? Is this all your stuff? Yeah. It is? What are you asking on that? Two bucks. Two bucks? Here you are. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So I was actually pretty surprised with everything that I found today. As you can see, it turned out pretty well. So the first thing that I stumbled across were these electronic drumsticks. So these you actually put batteries in, there is a speaker at the bottom of them and you can drum on different surfaces and it makes a noise. Probably get about 25 or $30 for these. So I got this along with this cell phone holder for a car, as you can see right here. Originally, I just wanted these. He wanted $10. I offered five, he countered it eight. Then I decided, hey, let me see if there's something else I can find, group them together. I found these, offered him 10 for both. He countered at 12. That's a fantastic deal, especially because 
This thing alone will probably go for about 15 bucks, and we'll say these about 30. Next thing that I found were these PGA Tour beanies. Now, because they are PGA Tour, and they still have the tags on them. They were slightly expensive. She wanted $5 a piece for them, but this one has a tag on the back, normally going for $20, and it was on sale for $9.97, um, but I can probably still list these for about $12 or $15. So $10 for both of them. If I can get 15 bucks for both, that'll be a $20 profit. And the next thing that I came across were, of course, Pokemon cards. This first one right here, actually this Magneton, is going for about $20 to $30 because it's holographic. As I went through the rest of the cards, these are the newer gen cards, so you know, not a whole lot of money to make on these. So all these cards together, I could probably get maybe 50 bucks for all of them if the right person buys them. The next thing that I got were another pair of brand new golf hats. The tag on the back says MSRP $21.99. So that's a piece. I got both of these hats. The guy originally wanted $3. I said two for five. Of course he took that deal. And I'm gonna sell these for $14.99 per hat. You know, right there, it looks like it's almost a $100 day, but I haven't even gotten to the best part yet. The next thing that I picked up for $2 was this child small Tony Romo Cowboys hat. Not totally sure, but I know these children's jerseys go for about 20, 25 bucks. So on a $2 investment, can't really go wrong. And finally, we hit the jackpot on golf clubs. Today we found an entire iron set. What's really great about these is that they are Nike. So these are the Pro Combo Editions. So these are gonna be worth a little bit more because they're pretty close to Tor issued. Uh, the guy originally wanted $60 for all of them, but they only are a three iron through a nine iron. So it doesn't have a pitching wedge. Um, it didn't come with a putter. So I ended up countering at $40. He said that was okay, but also I was looking for the putter. But I actually found this really cool Lynx putter. I've never seen this before, but it's a really cool uh, mallet shape. So he threw this in for an additional $5. He originally wanted 10, so 50 for everything with this brand new putter, but then he went down to $45. So I was extremely excited after some time not finding any clubs to finally pick up an entire iron set. So overall going a little bit later really didn't turn out to be that bad. So I'm not gonna make a habit out of going later, but I'm definitely gonna do it occasionally. So if you haven't already, be sure to like and subscribe, drop a comment below, and turn on your notifications so you know when I post my next video. Thanks for watching.